Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be a July favourites. Without further ado, let's get into what I have been loving in the month of July. Yes. So, starting off with makeup as I usually do, the first thing I have absolutely been loving is this makeup brush. Now this is the Zoeva 102 Silk Finish Brush. I have honestly been loving this. I, I've really gone off my beauty blender. I've not used it for the whole month of July and I've been dedicated to this brush because I just think this is such a gorgeous brush. It's amazing quality. It's synthetic hairs. It blends out my foundation so flawlessly. This brush is amazing at blending cream products out, foundations, anything. I love this and because it's so big as well, it gets the job done so quickly and I just love this so much and I have definitely like not used my beauty blender this month and this has been my absolute favourite. I just love using brushes now for foundation. I don't know what's happened to me. During the month of July, I've honestly been loving glosses and like I just stayed away from matte lips because I feel like they look really drying, they look very too much I think sometimes. I have just been loving glosses, moisturising lip products. So like my first favourite is this and this is what I've actually got on today and this is the Burt's Bees Lip Shine and I used this every single day when I was away in America. I found this in Walgreens and honestly it saved my trip because I was constantly like had glossy lips that was so moisturised but also tastes really nice because this is so delicious and yeah I really love this and I've literally used nearly a full tube of this already so I have already got a black up. So my next product is my absolute favourite. The Jouer Lip Topper in Skinny Dip. I wore this on my birthday. I wore it from the moment I got it and I've not stopped wearing it. This gives the effect of a metallic lip. It isn't, I wouldn't say it's glossy glossy. I'd say more of a, a moisturising lip cream that's got a metallic effect. So it just makes your lips look like golden metallic goodness. It is just beautiful and I love wearing this when I'm going out either like the evening if I'm going out for a meal or even in the day when I'm wearing hardly anything on, like hardly any eyeshadow on but makes you look like a goddess, like a golden sunny bronze goddess. I just love this so much and if you don't know where you can get your way from, you can get it from Beauty Bay now which is amazing because I love Beauty Bay and they have all of the lip toppers. If you don't go on Beauty Bay, you can get it on Cult Beauty. So you can get you a, a lot of online stores, which is amazing. But I honestly, if you've been wanting this for so long, I really recommend you getting it because it's been like my summer staple and I just love this so much. It's so pretty. Then this is really boring, but I honestly thought this is a necessity. And it's a lip balm, which is Burt's Bees, and it's a four hour moisturization ultra conditioning lip balm. This is really, really good. It has like such a moisturizing feel. And when you wake up in the morning, you still have it on, which I think is amazing. So if you're looking for a good lip balm that isn't too expensive, I really recommend this because, yeah, the ultra conditioning one is just so amazing. So, my next favorite. Oh, I just love this one so much. So, honestly, this month, I have been very adventurous. I have just loved colour this month. I have just been loving really funky coloured highlighters. So, this month, I have honestly been loving so much the Strobe of Genius palette from NYX. And this is just phenomenal. Phenomenal. <laughs> It's amazing. So you've got like your natural. Hey, don't close on me like that. So you've got like your natural highlighters, your everyday, day to day highlighters. So you've got like the bronzy one, you've got a really white gold blinding highlighter, and then you've got like a champagne one, which is very similar to Becca Champagne Pop. 
And then here you've got the darker one for darker skin tones I reckon. Um, but you can use these for eyeshadows. So this shade is more of a pinky, burgundy, I want to say burgundy. This is like a pinky highlighter. This is absolutely beautiful. Like I wore this when I was wearing pink eyeshadow and a pink highlighter and it looked amazing. And if I can find a picture, I'll insert it now. But honestly, I like to tie in my highlighter with my eyes. It's so fun. Makeup is so fun and I love doing stuff like that. Like matching my highlighter to my eyes. Like, <coughs> So the next one is a blue, which I love. I love, 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 love. Then the next one is like another pinky one, which is the one that I used and I love this one. Then it's a gold one. There's like a yellow gold, which I don't know if you can actually tell, but today I have a yellow highlighter on. Can you believe it? Can you believe it? So this has been like a mini tester of a highlighter palette that I wouldn't think I'd be using, but with me trying this out, it's making me really, really want to by the Anastasia Aurora palette because that has got some really cool highlighting shades. So, yeah, this is such a good palette and for the drugstore, I'm not kidding. The pigmentation is incredible. They're so buttery and soft, which I didn't expect. And yeah, NYX killed it again with the highlighters and yeah, I just love NYX and the products and this is a, such a good palette. You definitely need this if you love highlighters like me. I have honestly been in love with the Urban Decay Full Spectrum palette this month. The colours in here are insane. Insane is not even the word. It's like beyond gorgeousness. But the colours in here are just incredible. I have honestly been loving the yellow, the greens, the purples. The colours in here are just gorgeous and it's just beautiful and I love this so much and I feel like it's such a staple if you are into makeup like me and you haven't got a coloured palette. I, I really do recommend this palette from Urban Decay. Urban Decay do amazing palettes but this one is just insane. Yeah so I have honestly just been loving the colour this month. So for my fashion favourites this month I have been loving my clear framed glasses and these are fake but these are from Pull and Bear and they are beautiful. I love wearing these with and without makeup so if I'm wearing quite a simple makeup I just think it's these are so chic to put on but I also love wearing these when I am wearing no makeup so if I'm wearing no makeup and I've got my denim jacket on but I've got no makeup on it just looks really cool and effortless like if I've got these on, I don't feel as bad without wearing makeup and I just think they look really effortless and they just pull an outfit together so well. Oh! Ugh. This, honestly, this month, I have, I don't know what's happened to me, but I have been into colour, I have been into denim so much, I've been into edgy stuff and when I mean edgy, I mean real edgy. So I picked up a pair of fish nights fish nights what so i picked up a pair of fishnet socks and these like at first i wasn't too sure on how to style them but i'm not kidding i love these so much so i love wearing these with like a dress like quite a cash dress um like a t-shirt dress with fishnets and converse look amazing fishnets and heel boots look incredible i love wearing this with my denim skirt it just looks so nice and I don't know. I feel like it just makes an outfit a lot more different and edgier and cooler. And um, yeah, I love wearing these with white converse and I love wearing these with boots. And I just love these so much. And these ones were from Primark. Yeah, they were only £2 and I got two pairs. I'll insert a picture of me of them now of me wearing them because I've honestly been obsessed with them. And I can't stop wearing them. It's an addiction. So for song favourites, I have been loving Dua Lipa's um, New Rules. This came out when I was in America and I heard it and was obsessed with it. If you haven't heard it, definitely go watch it. I will put a link in the description. There's no excuse because it's incredible. <laughs> And then, 
what else have I been loving? Oh, I have honestly been loving Glory by Bastille. Oh my god, I love Bastille. Bastille and Dua Lipa are my favourites. Glory is just such a good song. So that's it for my July favourite this month. I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, you know what to do. Give it a thumbs up and if you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel because I have hit 700 subscribers. What the blooming bum drops has happened to me? Like, what? Yes. That is crazy. So thank you so much for subscribing. It means so much to me and I just love this so much. And yeah, it's crazy to think 700 people have clicked that button down below and basically want to watch me, which is crazy. So thank you very much for subscribing. But yeah, if you haven't already, definitely subscribe. I honestly, it means the world to me when people subscribe. I get so happy and yeah, definitely click the bell button. So every time I upload, it will notify you. Then you will never miss a video, literally. So yeah, that's it for today's video and I will see you on Wednesday. Bye!